I'd like to welcome everybody into Morning Moments with Jesus today. Pray that this day will find you in a blessed position to serve the Lord Jesus Christ. So today in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, the Lord takes us to verse 57 and 58. It says, Thanks be to God, which gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be ye steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord, for as much as you know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. So there's three things this morning that I really want to share with you about the recovery or the restoration process. And the first thing is, is that it is a process. It's not a quick fix. It's not something that you can just go into a meeting or a program and then in one sitting or in one night walk out and say everything's fine now. It's a process of growth and God will begin to take you through all the layers of that growth and bring you to that place of restoration and recovery. And the thing we need to realize about that is even if we don't understand all that's going on, We need to trust that process because that process works. I love what it says here in the word that says that we need to give thanks to God, which gives us the victory through the Lord Jesus Christ. The second thing about restoration or or that recovery process that we need to really embrace is that it is something that needs to be possessed. In other words, you need to take ownership of your recovery. You need to take ownership of of that pathway back to the place or even beyond the place that you used to be before uh, life derailed you. We understand this and we know this to be true, that people can't fix us. And we need to stop blaming everybody else sometimes for our problems or our situation. Taking ownership of that moment, that, that recovery process is huge in building that restoration. The third thing I want to share with you before I leave you this morning is that if you want to be in that recovery process and you want that process to work, then there should be progress. We can't always be broke. We can't always be speaking of what's wrong with us. At some point, we've got to start talking about what Jesus is doing I say a lot in our in our time at Sunrise Chapel, I say this a lot, but we need to quit talking so much about what the devil is doing to us and start proclaiming what God is doing for us through Christ Jesus. There has to be progress. There has to be a healing and, and a moving forward in your life. So today I want to speak and pray a blessing over your recovery process. If there's anybody out there this morning In our morning moments, family, or even beyond, maybe somebody you share this with this morning. I'd love to hear from you through your comments on YouTube or or the podcast. Just, Just let us know if we can pray for you. Because we're all going through this together, step by step, moment by moment, decision by decision. We are making progress. So today I want you to be safe, be strong, and always be blessed. If you need to, find yourself a good recovery program that will wrap yourself, wrap around you a peer group and a group of people who are in the same situation and on the same path you are, but will we'll love you beyond your flaws, beyond your faults, beyond anything you could ever imagine because it's the love of Christ flowing through them. Hope you have a great and wonderful day.